Ready to drink cocktails are very popular right now. And just in time for summer, Copper Wing Distillery in St. Louis Park has a new one out. I love the name of this, 75 and Sunny. Joining us <laughs> now live is Toph Huback. And tell us, first of all, before we start talking about this uh, cocktail that's so exciting, tell, tell us a little bit about Copper Wing and how the place got started. Sure, Copper Wing was uh, started in 2017, so we just celebrated our five year anniversary. Um, it was started by a doctor, a lawyer, an engineer uh, who decided to start a bar, and that's the end of the joke. But um, <laughs> our, our engineer became our master distiller, and we've been working on it. They brought me on in 2018, and, and ready to drink cocktails have been our latest focus. So tell us about 75 and Sunny. It's your first canned cocktail. Why expand into that category? Uh, so far, our re uh, ready to drink cocktails have all been very spirit forward, things like old fashions and Negronis. Um, great for the year, um, but one of my favorite classic cocktails is a French 75. Uh, it's always been one of our most popular cocktails in the cocktail room, and our um, guests have been asking when we've been doing when we make a a, a full version. Um, when the opportunity came to collaborate with Wine Haven Winery, another uh, a, a local winery, um, we I was uh, I was excited to be able to combine local Minnesota wine and create a cocktail that anyone can enjoy uh, out at their events. Well, tell us about that French 75 that was the inspiration. What is that involved? What does that drink involve? So uh, French 75 is, is gin, uh, generally uh, fresh lemon juice and champagne, and a little bit of sweetness added to it. So it um, is kind of like my, what I recommend somebody who wants to try gin for the first time. It's very approachable, um, refreshing, and with the combination of wine just sort of is sneaks up on you and, and it can be a really uh, great thing to enjoy with friends. So what about the 75 and Sunny? How does that taste? So with 75 and Sunny, we decided to make a, a what we call a brute version or an extra dry version. Um, as uh, alcoholic seltzers got more popular in the recent years and people started moving towards drier cocktails, um, we wanted to find a way that, to sort of split the difference, something that um, was full flavored but lower in sugar, drier, and then also allows um, a little bit of room to add some of your own sweetness and modifiers. Well, it already sounds pleasant before you even try it. 75 and sunny, it just puts you in a good space before you even take a sip. What are the other products that you have at Copper Wing? Uh, so we make a bourbon, uh, which is now five years old, um, which is very exciting for us. We make a vodka, um, a unique product called Vodski, which is an unaged spirit with character, um, and two different gins. We've got our traditional gin, which is utilized in the 75 and sunny, as well as what we call Phrasis, which is a strawberry infused pink gin. All right, and then we know that your facility there, you've got a cocktail lounge and a bottle shop, right? That's right. Uh, the bottle shop, we now are allowed to sell 750s thanks to uh, our law change last week, and we've been very excited to do that as all the distilleries I have. Well, Toph, thank you so much for joining and bringing a little sunshine to this dreary sort of morning for yeah, us. We needed it. We needed it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for having us. Yes, we appreciate it.